guys, it's me again, and today, um, I'm going to give you guys, like, not really an island tour, it's more of an island progress check, because I'm not finished. I have a four star island, and this video is going to be in three parts, and here, let me show you after I get loaded. So, how's your day going? Mine's doing okay. I have to hold this up while I play, it's a bit hard, but I'm doing good. So yeah, like I said, this is an island progress check and not really, um, a, like, tour. Like, my island isn't completely finished yet. I guess it's a tour, but it's more of a progress check. So this is my outfit that I have on now. Let me get this. Y'all can see that. Okay. So let me pull up my map. Okay, so yeah, my island is called Kawaii 12, and the reason why I named it that was because um, I have the, I also have the game Tomodachi Life. It's kind of like Animal Crossing, except you like take care of me, I guess, and I named that Kawaii 10 for some reason. I don't know, I guess I was 10 years old or something, and I kind of wanted my Animal Crossing name to be like sort of related to that. And I was like, well, I want it to be close, and I didn't think Kawaii 11 sounded good, so we went with Kawaii 12. And as you can see here, these are the residents. My name is Luna, this is me, and my this is my sister, her name is Star. And as you see, we have a lot of paths going on, so let's just get started. Okay. So this is my house. Hang on, I gotta fix it. Sorry if I'm moving weird. Okay. So over here is my garden area. I have this rose bed. Then I have some fire flowers over here. And I have this <coughs> like white heart bouquet on this stone thing because it's next to the white parts and then um i might do a house tour maybe i guess but my house is a bit messy so might maybe not soon okay so then over here this is my sister's house she almost has the entire house she just needs the basement and in front of that she did some decoration over there over here i have a birdhouse my diy bench this thing which makes Princess Peach come out of it, not Peach Daisy, this flower sign because you know it's in front of the flowers. Then I have my pumpkin patch, we have a scarecrow protecting it, and I water it every day. Over here we have my backyard, like we can have tea or a barbecue, and I keep my bicycle and my lawnmower back here. And now, <coughs> going up. Front here, we have this cute little panda panda dog tea party, just a stuffed animal tea party. We have some roses. We have the anniversary cake, and this is like it's like what you can order. And then we just have this, I guess, cute little seating area with trees and pink balloons. So we have we also have two different types of tea sets because I thought that looked really cute. And going over to the beach area, we have some flip-flops by a chair. These are pretend like someone's flip-flops next to, and you have next to a coconut tree. And then we have these beach towels, and I have I put this on top of it, so it's like an umbrella covering you. And then we have a beach ball, we have a palm tree lantern, and fishing rod and surfboard. And over here, so you might see a lot of this. I put like the paths that you can't plant stuff on as like a barrier and then I started planting more flowers so that the flowers don't overgrow but there's still more flowers around. So you'll see a bunch of that. This is, you might have seen this in one of my videos, it's like, a, it's the green festival dancing area. Most of the villagers come here to dance or sing. And then up here is just, looks cranny, we have a waterfall in front of it. Oh look, Judy's sitting up there. Oh yeah, um, 
The trees that I have are oranges, I mean peaches. This is an orange tree because we decided to add more trees. This is another garden behind Nook's Tranny. And going up, we have Bam's house with this thingy. It's a spinny wheel. wheel. And then we go from Bam's house, we have this hammock that most of the villagers sleep in. And over there, we'll check over there maybe in the next video. This is going to be in three or three or four parts, I don't know. But in this video, I'm just showing the middle part of my island. If you saw on the map, this is my sister's backyard. And then, bam, and then this is Cat's house. I don't know why we put this gong here. I think we got it when we were first playing. So, we decided to make bam and cat neighbors, and I really like how this fencing is like, they can visit each other, like going across here, and it's just easier for them. <laughs> Now going up front, we have some more flowers. Over here is resident services. We have more flowers over here, a balloon. And I, what I did is that I put the stone fencing all the way around it and then the hedges on the sides of it because I thought that looked really cute. We have the 2021 arch, a park clock, this adorable puppy plushie. And our festival flag, and then it just leads into here. Moving on, if we go down here, that's my airport, I have a green one. And then we go along here. This is the museum, we have this face thing that you can... Ah, uh, stop, 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 begin, begin the face. And look, a bunny. So this is the museum, and I did a bit of decoration up for the beach up here. I like it near the beach. And then right here, it's supposed to be like an exhibit, but outdoors, it's the mammoth. And I, it took me a long time to get both parts. I was going to do the T-Rex, but it took me too long, so I just settled with the mammoth. And I put the rope fencing around here. I put the sand flowing, so it's like a little exhibit you can see. Also, it does, it like covers the space, so there's not just a big empty space. We have a director's chair and this trash so you don't litter inside of the museum you put your trash in the trash can then we have this cute like turkey day decorations over here and then following the path over here i'm gonna put like pink and red roses over here and then we go over here and then we have the able sister shop i got this during wedding season we didn't really do much with it and i didn't know where to put them so i just put them in front of the Able Sister Shop and it's been there ever since, it looks nice. We have this year We're Open sign, even though they're not like open on 24 7 just for the 9 till 9 o'clock. We still think it looks cute, my sister put it there. And then, oh that's right here, let me show you in um, my custom designs because it'll be easier. So this... Uh huh. This, no, not this one. Okay. Oh my God! Stop. Okay, here. Let me show you. This is our flag. It's like a. It's a moon with a pretty background. And, like, I don't take full credit for this. I didn't make this up on my own. I searched up online a bunch of different flag ideas because, like, I have no ideas on my own. And it's also really hard for me to do it. So I look up and try to copy it. So this is my best trying to copy the moon and the star. I don't remember who was by I and I didn't even check the QR codes. But I just tried my best to copy it and added a bit of different touch-ups. I think it looks really cute. So this is my island flag. And yep, that's the tour. That's This is part one of our tour. Here, I'll show you the map again. So you can know. Oops. I'll show you the map again. So you know what part we're doing next time. So, so if you see this river, we have the middle part, which is what I just showed you. Next time, I'm going to show you this right part. And then... 
maybe like a little bit of the cliffs and then on the last part maybe there might be another part I'll show you the left side of the island and more of the cliff areas so yep that's all gonna be for today make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time bye